this next problem asks us to combine this two radical expressions into a single radical. First, we look for uh, the prime factors of the respective radicands and write the cube root of 2 squared, that's for 4, times x to the 4th y squared, and the cube root of, for 6, we have 2 times 3, times x squared y. Next, we multiply using the law of radicals, which says that the cube root of this number times the cube root of another number is the cube root of their product. So we have 2 squared times 2, that's 2 cubed, times x to the, or times 3, times x to the 6, times y cubed. Then we write the radicand as the product of two factors, one of which is a perfect cube, so that we can apply the law of radicals and take that perfect cube out. For two cube, we have two cube. Three will be written as part of the other factor. For x to the six, we have x squared cube. And for y cube, we have y cube. So we can take this 2x squared y out because we have the cube root of a perfect cube times the cube root of the remaining factor, which is just 3. So the single radical expression, which is equal to this original product, is 2x squared y times the cube root of 3.